Yeah, they are. Thick. Big ass. Air strafer. Strafing's rubbish in this game. Oh. It's not slow. I mean, it's not fast. It is slow. Wasn't there... There were some low gravity maps in Quake 3 as well, weren't there? Ah. Yeah, I don't remember the others. This one's, I guess, the most unique. So I don't think the others have gimmicks, really, do they? Or is one of them the wind tunnels, or is that a required level? Oh my days! so difficult to aim when you learn that you just have to aim lower. Space maps here. Oh, I don't have to imagine the size of their junk. I may or may not have seen pictures. No, I'm not that weird. Or am I? That's up to you to decide. Depends which side of the fence you're on. Is is he joking about half of the sexual comments he says? Or is it legit? The the greatest mystery plaguing mankind. Oh dear. Oh dear, don't slide. <coughs> Ow, my toes. I wish I could embrace them. Their girth. Sorry, whoever's come here just for some nice Quake video. Wait, this game has some relatively sexiness in it as well. What is that? The fiends are alright, but that's about it, actually. But who could disagree with the final boss? Tentacles, man. Is that a thing? There is something sticking out there, isn't there? A shambler. What are Timbs? What? What is this new meme? Keep seeing Timbs. Ugh. The New York Times. Wait, that is a thing. Excuse me. I'm not settling for that. It's obviously a way to get somewhere. It's just not where I jumped to. Hup. I found it. What is this? It's nothing. And then it just ends. What is that? Some pointless cheese. Ugh. Oh. Grab the edge. Oh, where did you come from? It's a very stupid level. I hate it. No, it's cool. It's just arsehole. I was trying to collect it, but the jump failed for some reason. As in, I failed. Because this game is perfect in every way, and there's no way it could glitch. Kind of, anyway. Right, what we got up here? I already pressed that. Did I already do everything up here? I guess so. Huh. Outdoors, brown clothes the Tim, but Tim's mostly refers to their shoes. Oh. I don't know. I wouldn't bang anything that's wearing trendy clothing, because clothing gets in the way. Whoa, look at that dude. Isn't he enjoying life? Or is he just art? I don't know if I don't know if he's actually real. What the hell? Ah no! Look at this mayhem. At least they don't run around when they're firing grenades all the time. Oh what am I gonna are there even no there aren't two up there. 
What's a boy to do? Probably get rid of him first. Well, that's just a waste of ammo, that is. This is a bad idea. It is. Whatever. It worked. And there's some hefty health over there, so I'll have that in a bit. Jump didn't work again. What happened? What a bunch of idiots. Hang on, I'm going to have to look this up quickly. I usually don't like looking stuff up in a proper stream, just casual ones, but... Tim's shoes. Shambler wearing lingerie, maybe. I would have to not look at their face though, because it's just a big mouth or something. Although that could satisfy the Vore people. They're just worker shoes. Why are they yellow? That's a horrible colour. I guess they look alright though, otherwise. They got a spongy ankle bit. Yeah, they just look like yellow work boots. You also don't have to worry about min-maxing the health pickups as in getting to 100% before you pick up the big healths in this game because it counts down. Unlike Doom, where you have to wait until you get 100% before you pick up a soul sphere. Are you dead? You are. Bonk. Yeah, well, I mean, I guess it's alright in some situations, like P. No! But it's probably one of my less favourite colours. Yeah, green is good, because that's the colour of lizards, generally. There's another one of those things! No, blue is the colour of... Color of Soink the Hodgehead. Oh god, there's another one. Fucking hell, man. Save it. Ah. Uh. Oh. Who can deal with them in that situation? What have I done? I jumped to get a better vantage point on that, or rather, get away from the splash damage of my grenade. But I didn't realise that would fling me right into the shambler. Wait, where is all that? It's further up. Huh. 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 Bloody shambler paradise. But red is my favourite colour. Because blood, <laughs> yum. No. Because the seemingly most common colour for dragons, probably, is the main reason. It's the colour of my dragon, anyway. Durgan. How am I gonna alert this guy without getting zapped? Bong! Where are you? It's, it's like a puzzle level, I don't want to jump too high. You should like yellow. Oh yeah. No, that's gold. Gold is far superior. Although I guess the it's kind of more orange than gold on the head scale plate things. Alright, maybe we'll just have to tank it. We have got a mega health coming up anyway, after all. Oh, I can't take two zaps. Oh. This is impossible. This game is impossible. Who invented it? Probably some... some plonk. Oh, wait, invulnerable... right. I forgot this game... I mean, this level had that. I didn't even pick them up. What an idiot! I ain't even been in here. No invulnerability run. Apparently. Try it. No, it's gonna be wasted. Quick. 
Oops. I... You're keeping me up too long. Oh god. Oh god. Luckily there's another one. Oh, oh. Huh. There we go. Can I get over there in time? It's so manky. Ugh. A shower? Fuck. Way to ruin my day. No, you can't shower now. You're supposed to watch the stream. Chonk. Right, uh, let's get that at the end of the level, probably. Hi. Oh, oh, I thought that was a grenade falling down. We've already had that quote. We need more quotes. Uh, there's like 0.01 chance of having the same quote ever show up. What? No, that's not how that works at all. No matter how many quotes you have, this is very suspicious. There's a 100% chance that the same quote will show up at some point. If they used long enough. Is this evil? Yeah, it is. Are they dead? I don't know, they're like floating around. Oh, it takes forever. Yeah, it is rather nice lighting. The thing is, I don't know how much of it is legit, or how much is source porty, But I think it's usually nice in the original game as well anyway. Even in its all... Even in its old, crusty pixeliness. If you strafe in a circle... Wait, what? I don't know. I don't know, I'm probably misunderstanding. Cluster in the air if you strafe in a circle. Oh, wait. Wait, is that why people sometimes do that thing in speedruns where if they're about to jump, they do that sort of half circle where they fling themselves before jumping? Maybe that gives them a bit of a boost. Hurt me all you like, I've got a mega health coming up. What is this all about? Don't know, it's probably a secret to everyone. Hmm, yeah, I've wondered about that for ages. I don't know the technique though. Right, never mind the secrets, I'm out of here. This place is braining me. Whatever that means. Actually, isn't that when you, like, bash someone's brain in? With a crowbar. That they kindly found. Oh. I'll get there one day. You know, it's not like my health is slowly draining or anything. God, uh... Oh, that's not ammo. I thought I saw nails over here. Hup. Bye, stupid level. It's cool, though. Ah. Gloom Keep. More like Super Pickle the Legend of Gloom. 
the best platformer I ever made. Not really though. The level where you're supposed to encounter your first shambler, usually, I do believe. Oh. In here, or something. What is that? Oh, it's in the music. Some weird sound effect that sounded like my computer was making a weird sound. Straight left while slowly looking to the left. Then switch up and strafe right. What? That's too complicated. Oh, what? Draken? How do you remember that far back? Probably because it's Draken. That sounds like something I would say, though. I haven't changed. God, what an idiot younger me was. Of course my favourite beverage is a bottle of pee from, from Arok. No. Well, maybe. It depends what it tastes like. Dragons are magical, so it might be really nice. It might taste like liquid magic. Helen! Probably shouldn't have got that yet. Let's leg it and make the most of it. I'm still going to have to replay Draken at some point. It's one of those games that's worth a redo. Because the quality of the original was so old and crap. Die. You're supposed to die from two grenades. Oh. How dare you trap a secret? That's just not fair. Complete dickery. Hickory dickery. Hickory dockery dick. Hello? Oh no. Ah! I hate being out of nails, it's the worst fate for anyone. Someone sent the elevator down. That's, that's as many rockets as I'm wasting on you. Three rockets to kill an enemy that dies in one rocket and it didn't even die. Oh, you grew up watching my vid- hi! Watching my videos. And I'm sure you turned out completely normal as a result. I hope you didn't though. Normal is boring. I don't remember how bunny hopping works in Half-Life. There's some games that I like where they do it, where if you just keep strafing and like holding the jump button as you go along, like you repress it before you land and you jump immediately upon hitting the ground and you pick up speed as you go, like in Dusk. I don't remember how Half-Life did it, but I guess I guess you're saying it's one that does it where you turn the, the camera. I wouldn't mind learning how to do that at some point, just for a, just for the hell of it. I'm not a speedrunner, but it'd be interesting to learn. Oh, you love dragons as well. Good. Everybody should. have more respect points, because previously you were just a, a mere mortal, but now you're a mere mortal who likes the superior beings. What? What's that noise? Chonk! There's Cthulhu's Dildo 0.2. Slightly improved over the original version because it's not a one time use. It pulls back out afterwards so it can be used multiple times. 
but still not perfect. I think we can hear the perfect ones, where they just keep on ramming back and forth for all eternity. So that any silly humans who get caught in it have to live in eternal pleasure. Or any other creatures who might be into that. Not only humans like dildos. Ow. Get out of here, spammer. Oh god, there's another one. Oh no, is this the elevator? Or is this just a... No, it's not. I think the elevator has four spike turrets around it. a good game. I feel like I remember it being a bit of an asshole of a game. Sometimes, like not very good mechanics or something, but I don't know. I don't remember exactly what bits. Although I do remember a, a room that's quite late in a game where it's a bunch of crushy ceilings that are going up and down and that was very trial and error for me. I think I did a highlight of that back when I streamed it, because it was very silly. Spyro. Good, we love disappointment disappointments around here. My love of dragons probably just came from because I liked dinosaurs as a kid. So it was a natural evolution. But yeah, Spyro probably helped it along as well. Chong! This place is just full of twats. Everywhere. Coming from everywhere. Oh. Oh, oh dear. Right. Oh god, there's a grenade man as well. Oh god. somehow. Don't finish me off, there's more health here. 69. Unfortunately, after an encounter with a night guy, which is not my idea of sexy. I don't know, it depends what they look like under the armour. Not that I'm the kind of person who judges someone based entirely on how they look. 